Hey everybody, it's Tim at Broken Dice, being a quick little channel update, and this will be a quick one. Uh, got me another unit of Pike done, and I am exceedingly unhappy with these guys. And it has nothing to do with the model, it has everything to do with my painting. I tried something different, and it didn't work out. Uh, I'm not going to strip them and do them again, they're just a big old pipe block, but... I tried painting them on the sprue before I assembled them. And I didn't like that at all. I, I persevered. I went through the entire unit thinking, okay, I'll get a handle on this. I'll get a handle on it. And even when I came to, to putting them together and assembling them on the bases and stuff, after painting and you got to go back and, uh, you know, touch up where you've uh, cut them off the, the sprues and stuff, I don't know. I didn't like it. I don't like my color choice of this this weird green I got. Uh, I used, I don't know, you can see on this guy's, like this green here. Not really thrilled with that. Um, yeah, lesson learned. I don't like painting stuff on the sprue. I think I do better when the model is partially assembled. Like with these guys, normally I'll put them all together but the shield and then paint them like in batches and I don't know why I just it maybe it's psychological I don't know but it was kind of weird I did not like the process so this will be the last unit I do like that now as you can see over behind them through this camera this way uh, I have some Macedonian cavalry and to the left there I have Greek cavalry and I'm going to be painting those next this will be my last pike block for some time for my Macedonians. Just, yeah, I've reached that saturation point when you're doing a unit and you just kind of look at it and you got units on your in your army and you go, I think I've painted enough of those for a while. I did the same thing in my, um, like my English Civil War army. I, I did a bunch of pike blocks for that and, uh, I really looked forward to the uh, uh, artillery pieces and, and baggage trains and stuff like that. Um, I've already got that stuff done for this kind of time period, so there's none of that. So I'm going to uh, put these guys aside for a while. I'm going to paint up some cavalry next. And this project will be... I got to say almost 90% done. I got a few character models I want to add to it. But other than that, once I get this uh, cavalry done, um, I think it'll be 90% uh, done. I have the starter army for successor kingdoms from Warlord Games. I don't know. Uh, I've got, this will be my sixth block of pikemen. So, phalangites, if you will. But uh, I don't think I'll be uh, adding any more of those. Uh, maybe another war elephant. Uh, maybe some light cavalry. I don't know. Maybe something that uh, the uh, something odd from the Seleucids. I I do have uh, Seathwheel chariots already painted up for them. So I don't know. Uh, something quirky probably. Nothing so. Uh, batch as a, another block of pike for quite some time. Well, that's the end of this video. Everybody stay safe, stay well, and I'll see you next time.